So my teacher seven, Mr. Barry here. Today I want to look at using this Acer Chromebook 15 with touchscreen with Android apps. So let's get started with the video. Now this video is a slight departure from my normal fare because normally what I have is I have educational videos and also other types of reviews or how-to videos. On this one, I've been getting a large response of emails asking me, well, how does this new Chromebook that I've been testing, this Acer Chromebook 15, how does it do with Android apps and particularly 3D games? So what I did was I went in and I'm going to show you how to start the Play Store, make sure that it's working, and then I'm going to do a search and I'm going to install the game called Warhammer 40,000 Free Blade. First off, you need to go up to the three dots, that's the Customize Control menu, click it. Menu comes down and then click on Settings. Then your Settings comes up as you see here. Now on the side it says Settings again, click that and you see a sidebar come up. Go all the way down to Play Store and click it. Now on this window if it says Install or Enable Play Store, go ahead and click on Yes. If not, you already have it. Now find the Play Store icon which should appear on the shelf at the bottom of the screen. Click it and the Play Store should load. As you see here, it's already loaded and I'm doing a search for Freeblade. Now once you've found the 3D game that you've been looking for, go ahead and click on the green button that says Install and you'll install it. That might take a couple minutes to 10 minutes depending on how fast your internet speed is. Now for the actual game that I recorded that we're going to be seeing here in a few moments, I used two things. One was an app called Screencastify on my Chromebook and that was able to capture my screenplay. I also used a little camera on the outside to show where my fingers were pointing and pressing during the gameplay. So let's see how good the graphics are on this Chromebook. On the world of Tarnis, a knight apparent undergoes the grueling ritual of becoming, hoping to be reborn as an imperial knight. Meanwhile, the dread forces of chaos launch a devastating attack. In the grim darkness of the far future, there is only war. You survived the ritual of becoming. Praise the Emperor. Listen, you are still disorientated after the ritual. Do you recall my name? I am Lucius Ironblood, sacristan of this noble house. Quickly, my lord, dispatch this heretic bill and move on. Find your brothers and repel the Chaos Invaders. I have word that the Adeptus Astartes are coming to our aid. Space Marines, my lord. Cash walls for filth! Your brother, I am sorry. There will be time to grieve later. You must press on.
enemy master to grace. Your deliverance is at hand. Hold on, Knight. Only in death does duty end. I am glad to see you have regained consciousness, Knight. I am Brother Sergeant Bedale of the Dark Angel Space Marines. Alas, I bear grim tidings. You are the last surviving Knight of House Dracus. We are only able to rescue the House of Tristan, Lucius, Ironblood, and a handful of others. It is with great sadness that I must document the fall of House Dracus. Although Fort Dracus burns, all hope is not lost. Brother Sergeant Medale, we have not forgotten our pact with the Dark Angels. We will rise from the ashes, join you in vanquishing our mutual foes, and create a new legacy. And what should this legacy be called? Freeblade. A strong name. It shall be the beginning of a glorious legacy, Freeblade. I will continue to act as your chronicler and advisor. Let us paint your war machine, so that you may strike terror into the hearts of our enemies. You will be able to change this later, if you desire. Welcome aboard the Fist of Caliban, our strike cruiser. Your arrival is timely indeed, Knight, for we have orders to repel an orc invasion force. Please join us at the campaign table. Well, there you have it. Now you've seen the gameplay of a 3D Android game being played on a Chromebook. Now I should say that the gameplay was actually very smooth, the video was great, and the touchscreen was very responsive to everything that was done there. Now I have three sons, and they are teenage sons, and they really hogged the machine and they were really playing that game, and that's how I was able to capture most of the video was with that. Now once you have the game, you don't need to go to the Play Store to restart it again in the future. All you have to do is click on the App Launcher found here in the lower corner, and then click on the game. And then you can tap Continue, and there you are. 
you're ready for more gameplay. Well, if you're watching this on YouTube, please give it a thumbs up, comment down below, and share the video. Thank you again, and bye-bye.